Random Docks is one of the busiest dockyards in all of the island of Sodor. It's where ships and engines and cranes alike are busy day and night, every day of the year. But poor Cranky the Crane never gets a nap. He never gets to sleep early, he works all the time, and his only company are the gulls that sit along his arm. So Cranky is always cranky, cried Salty, snapped Cranky. Bill and Ben arrived for work full of mischief, snapped Cranky, grumbled Bill, snapped Cranky, said Bill, said Ben, Cranky cranked, said Salty, cried Cranky, they chimed, Salty began, this made Cranky very cranky, so cranky that he swung his arm around and dropped the pipes onto the tracks instead of the trucks, said Cranky meekly, said Salty. The engines were trapped, saying Bill and Ben, so Topham Hat was in his office being measured for a new suit. When he heard the news, he left immediately for the docks, so Topham Hat knew that any delay at the docks could cause trouble, he said sternly. Cranky whispered. Cranky's heart sank as Salty uttered those faithful words. Wailed Cranky. Salty spent all night telling tales of powerful storms, daring rescues, and brave little ships. And when the sun rose, he was still talking and talking and talking, groaned Cranky. Harvey the crane engine arrived. He puffed proudly. Cranky was so pleased that the engines would be going soon. He forgot to be cranky, he promised. And after Harvey and the workmen had cleared away the wreckage, Cranky worked hard all day. He carefully loaded the trucks, helped speed the engines on their way, and he said please and thank you, puffed Thomas. But he had spoken too soon. Cranky couldn't help himself, said Percy. And all the engines laughed, but Cranky was still cranky.